Hi everybody, um, it's day 7 for me. I'm really excited to be making this video today because yesterday and the day before that, like I told you guys, was so freaking hard. Oh my god, it was like I thought that I was going to lose my mind. And I'm not even joking you guys, it was like to a point where I was praying like non-stop. I was literally like talking to God like please, please, please take this doubt out of my mind that this is something that I can't do. Just... It was it was insane, and I talked to you guys on the video. I talked to my sister. I called my friend, and that really really helped a lot. And now I'm on day seven, and feeling a lot a lot lot better because, I, like I said, I was looking at it as, as something like what ultimately helped me and kept me from cheating, which is what I thought I was gonna do. I thought of it something as something like this is a detox, and a lot of the time, I don't know about everybody else, but I let that word slip my mind. And then when I hear detox for something like this, I hear a physical like a, a fast or something but I'm not thinking like the way alcoholics detox and drug addicts detox and stuff like that but that's what we're doing we're on a detox from those things that we used to have and the things that we are craving like fat foods and stuff like that are symptoms so it's okay but you shouldn't eat you should ignore it ignore it ignore it ignore it and that's what I end up like taking it as like okay don't receive this as a feeling like oh I need to eat or something like that you're not hungry when you're hungry you drink your lemonade and you're fine you're craving fat food right now my stomach is actually rumbling for some juice because I've been up all morning and I haven't had much juice. I've just been drinking water because I did my salt water flush and then I started getting ready because I'm about to go to the store. Um, I'm expecting something important in the mail today. And my man is outside like literally, literally right now. So I'm excited about that. Um, I'm probably going to do my, I've been saving up this going to the um, store to the mall thing for a while actually because I wanted to save up my back to Mac stuff. I have like 12 things I'm going to take back. If you don't know what back to Mac is, it's basically if you buy products from Mac and if you find somewhere that they have the little um, two arrows in black and white, it kind of looks like a yang sign. And it means that if you take the container back to Mac, six of them, you can get something free. Some people, some Mac stores only will give you like a certain lipstick that they have out, but other stores will let you pick out, I think, like an eyeshadow or a lipstick. But either way, it's fun to get stuff for free and to recycle. So I'm doing two good things. I guess, no, I'm doing something good to get something in return. So that's awesome. Um, I'm excited about going to the store because I need some new clothes. Like, I don't have summer clothes. I just be wearing like jogging pants all the time, hoodies and stuff like that. I'm tired of wearing that type of stuff because I like to dress up. So I'll be back later on tonight with um, an update. And maybe if I get some new stuff, I can show you guys what I got. What else? Um, stay motivated. Always be feel free to message me and uh, comment on my videos and stuff like that. Let me know how you're doing. As of right now, I will show you guys a body shot, but I'm in the bathroom and there's no way to do that on this camera. Other than that, you guys stay uplifted. Um, what else? I think I mentioned everything. Uh, my sister's coming over on Friday, so I'll probably do my body shot then. So that'll be best so she can hold the camera for me. And then I'll probably weigh myself on Saturday. And that will be a week since the last time I weighed myself. Hopefully I see some inches. I mean, see some weight loss. If not, I won't necessarily be upset because I don't know what it is. But I'm starting to see this as more of a detox, like I said. As something that I'm doing good for my body and getting rid of a lot of the toxins. So I know that if I stay with this mindset, when I do come off of the cleanse, I will have gained a new perspective and I will learn how to eat right and exercise right and think right to be healthy. Even if I don't do all those things, I know sometimes when you're on the cleanse, the smallest thing, just one cracker, just one cracker is all you really, really want to just put your heart at ease, put your soul at ease. So I think I'll keep that mindset as well. And then maybe when I'm out and I'm eating stuff, I'll realize once upon a time you couldn't eat anything. So you should be happy to just have one serving of food or something like that. So that's it. I promise I'm done at this point because I'm almost at five minutes and I don't have a lot of space on my phone. My battery's about to die, but that's okay. Um, that's it. I'll talk to you guys later. And I'm feeling really good on day seven. So that's it. Bye.